All right, we're gonna try it again today. Uh, last couple days, the bike's been very, very, very slow. So today I'm gonna get out and uh, hopefully a little bit earlier than I got out the last couple of days. Tide's been really, really low. Uh, the fish aren't moving a lot. I've seen quite a few stacked up, but man, that bite has been tough with live or with jigs. Uh, so today I, I'm just hoping that uh, my fortune will change. I, uh, I put four citations in the boat this year already. Uh, my goal today is to add a fifth, maybe even a sixth citation. Uh, there are a lot of big crappie in this river. Now we just gotta get them to come in and bite. So I, I found a spot uh, where I've been marking quite a few. And I've got some decent ones out of there. I, I did catch uh, two citations. A friend of mine caught a, a citation out of there. So I knew there was some bigger crappie in there. Uh, so I'm moving away from the docks. I have not been fishing the docks as much. Uh, the fish just haven't been there, quite honestly. Other thing I'm doing is uh, you'll see kind of two pole rigs. Sometimes I'll go three with a short rod. Uh, but just down about nine foot, I'm fishing uh, a leader. Sometimes as far up as 18 inches and a uh, very small hook. And, and just uh, allowing the bait to kind of stay in the zone and hope that the crop will attack it. So today, uh, we'll get out. Beautiful day. Uh, temperature's 30. Uh, I expect that it'll go up a bit, but it's good that the temperature's dropped a little bit, I hope. Uh, hopefully the bite will be a little bit better. So we'll see you on the water. First on the go, about that. I didn't even know he was on here. Big old slab, man. He just sitting down on him. Wow, that's just that really is a nice fish right there. Nope, he stayed on here, he ain't going nowhere. Yeah, it's been a little over trail.
fire. So I got to tell you, today I'm doing something that I normally don't do on this lake. This lake I normally fish 9 to 10 foot. That's about it. That's why I catch all my crappie. I'm, I'm content. Uh, today though, they are biting it much deeper. Man, these things, some of them are down 15, 16 feet. And I'm getting some nicer fish. So I have uh, adjusted and we're going to do whatever needs to be done to try to fill that string up get my limit to that. So we'll see how that all plays out. Bite's still kind of slow, but I'm catching quality fish. Right there. Man, it's a strong fish. Very strong fish. Again, he's biting pretty deep. Now, these aren't as good as the ones down there, so... But the ones down there stopped biting and these are still going. So I, I will reserve any comments about not. Dilly dilly. Dilly dilly. Dilly dilly. This is what happened. This is what happens when you turn your camera off and catch one of these. Guess that'll teach me. I had no good cold been there in a minute. Okay, okay. Ask and it shall be given. Ask and it shall be given a good pole bender. That right there, my friends, is a nice little pole bender. That's what we call pole benders. That's a pole bender right there. Still, still got some hub in it. You know, full up hub cap. You got a little hub in it.
thought you were much bigger than me. And you know, I ain't take a lot. We got some nice fish out of here. Uh, most of them are at least 12, not bigger. Uh, so good slow day, but uh, all good quality fish. So this will make a make for a good video, but uh, make for a great fishing day. Now, you'll get some, you'll get some bait. You still get your boat up close to that and get in there. Hey, look here, look here, look at that rod, look at that rod. <laughs> oh man, I just missed one messing with you. <laughs> Sandwich meat right there. That's sandwich meat. Sandwich meat right there. Another day.